In this evening's business news, even with the ongoing pandemic, traffic is picking up in Deadwood. Gaming revenue this past August held steady with the same month last year. Got to Sydney Thorson brings you the story. While year to date gaming revenue in Deadwood is still down 10.45%, those numbers are gradually rising back up. This year's August only showed a 0.5% decrease. The summer's been fairly good for us and uh, we're, we're very happy uh, on how things have been recovering uh, post COVID, but uh, we still have a long way to go. Mike Rodman, the executive director of the Deadwood Gaming Association, says he remains cautiously optimistic. We're excited that we're able to start doing some of our events. Oktoberfest last weekend was very good for us. We're looking at uh, some uh, additional events coming up in the future. Casinos in town like Tin Lizzy are taking health precautions so customers and staff feel safe. Caleb Arsenault, the CEO of Live Hospitality, says the number of visitors staying in hotels is still down about 8%. I think I think it's been okay. Obviously, uh, in the, today's COVID world, it's it's been a difficult um, year, uh, and it's and it's difficult to continue to do business. But you know, Deadwood is doing a really good job with the Chamber of Commerce and the State of South Dakota to to really invite visitors into into town. Arsenault asked that visitors take personal responsibility and follow the guidelines that are placed throughout the casinos in Deadwood. Sydney Thorson, Hello Land News. And if you'd like to check out Deadwood's upcoming events in town, head to kettleland.com for links we provided under this story.